Hey guys, so it is August 7th, 2016, day 11 of liquid pre-op diet. Excuse the hair, I just got out of the pool. All right, so here's what we have going on. I started my liquid diet on July 28th, 2016 at 356 pounds. As of this morning, day 11, I am 345.1 pounds. So maybe tomorrow I'll be 344. So I think I'm doing pretty well. Um... I think I'm doing well. I think I'm losing, you know, a significant amount of weight. I don't know what the norm is for pre-op, but I still have till Thursday morning is my surgery or whatever. Actually, this is so, I was going to say the bad word. This is so messed up. Why do I have to call the day before at 2 o'clock to know? Like, really? Can it be like a couple days before? Really, at 2 o'clock in the afternoon is when I have to call to find out what time my appointment is, but whatever. Well, my surgery is, but at least I have a date, right? So, still getting everything in. Yesterday, I was a naughty girl. I had to drink everything, like, almost at one time. I got all my nail people in because I'm like, listen, I'm not doing any freaking nails for two weeks. Everybody better get their butts in. So, I did everybody's nails this last week up until this morning. Yesterday, I was in the chair all day. So, as soon as my list client left, I got my swimsuit on and ran out to the pool and got in there because... I really didn't feel like walking, but I wanted to get some energy in, or some energy in, God, Lord. Maybe I need to drink this now. I need to get some kind of workout in, but yesterday, because I was doing nails all day, I didn't drink, I didn't get my premiere in, I didn't do any of that shit, so when I came down the stairs, I was like, lightheaded, I guess I look pale, according to Googly, pale, pale, according to Googly Bear, so he chewed my ass up in one side and down the other and was like, what are you thinking? You're going to make yourself sick. And anyways, Googly Bear saved the day. He made me drink all my crap at one time. And I was just like, <laughs> but anyways, God love him. All right. So that is another, like, that's a concern of mine now, especially with having to have nail appointments, homework, and the kids homeschool. I really need to get my ass into gear and figure out a schedule for after my surgery. I am really hoping to be home by Saturday. Uh, my surgery is Thursday. I won't know the time until Wednesday. I have to call Wednesday at 2 o'clock. Really? The day before? Oh, and here's an update on my CPAP, guys. They're delivering it <laughs> Wednesday, the day before my surgery. Sometime, I was told, sometime in the afternoon through the evening. Even Comcast gives you a window. All right. So, anyhow... Yeah, but I need to really get my stuff together for the hospital. I haven't packed a bag. What do you pack? What do you guys pack for the hospital? I've heard people say, don't buy gas strips, buy gas strips. I don't know. You guys let me know. What do I need to pack? Um, do you even wear underwear home? <laughs> These are questions that I have. Like, with your cuts in your stomach, are you concerned with underwear? Are you wearing moo-moos home? Like, let me know, guys. Let me know what was in your hospital bag because I tried looking up a couple videos and I'm sorry I maybe I have a short attention span but I can't watch a 45 minute video about what's in your bag like I'm like come on show me phone premier protein pen swimmers ear drops you know what I'm saying like just just give me the info <laughs> so if anyone can help me out and put down below what you packed for the hospital what you didn't use what you used, and what you wish you would have packed, that would be very helpful. So that's it for today, guys. I will see you tomorrow. I go in the morning to pick up my clearance letter. They called Saturday and told me it was done, but I'm like, I'm not going into the city on a weekend. So I'm going to go tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock. It's an appointment, so I don't even know if I have to see him. He probably just wants to be able to bill my insurance. But I have to go tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock to pick up my clearance stuff. Thank God that's done. And then that is it. I don't have to go anywhere else until I head to the hospital on Thursday. And as soon as I find out my time, I'll let you guys know. Other than that, I have to go tomorrow to the DMV to renew my license because my birthday is next week and it's going to expire. And I'm probably not going to be in the mood to take pictures after surgery. So I'm like, I better get it out of the way now. All right, guys, this video is already five minutes long and I think I'm just rambling anyway. But I'm going to drink my premiere and be a good girl. I'm going to go hit the shower. Blow dry my hair and hope that I can do something with these bangs. I knew that once I got them, I would like them. But I also knew that they were going to have a mind of its own. And they do whatever they want to do. So I kind of have a... 
Diane Barr, Rosie O'Donnell thing going on here, which I don't like. So, uh, yeah, we're going to have to figure this out. All right, guys, love you and bye.